Next up, the name is a bit self-explanatory, so we're going to have Sam introduce the Decentralized News Network. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. My name is Samit Singh, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of DNN, or Decentralized News Network, and we want to bring transparency back into the news. So the problem here is threefold, right? We have this enormous level of distrust with the mainstream media. Uh, let's take the US as an example. Uh, so right now, only 32% of Americans have a reasonable amount of faith in the mass media to fairly and accurately report the news, and that's a historical low. On top of that, we have this whole issue of fake news, which seems to be spiraling out of control week after week, and it's coming to the point that we don't necessarily know if we can trust every single thing that we read. And this is also having the consequential effect of pushing writers to produce sensationalistic articles that target uh, ad revenue at the expense of factual reporting. So overall, much of the news that most of us in this room consume on a day-to-day -day basis is being created by these centralized bureaucratic corporations, and they all have their own political agendas in mind. And we don't think that's necessarily okay. So what can we do about it? With DNN, we're building a decentralized censorship news platform that will deliver factual source-based news to a community that's gonna be curated by readers, writers, and reviewers. So at a very basic level, the way this is gonna work is a writer would submit uh, content to a set of reviewers, a randomized set of reviewers on the platform, who will then uh, vet the article for factual integrity. So all of this will be approved by this randomized set of reviewers after they reach this majority vote consensus. And after that, it gets published to the blockchain and made available for readers to consume without the risk of ever being taken down. So all of this is underpinned by a unique two-token economy which we developed with the help of Smith & Crown. So users on the platform can both earn and spend tokens, but I want to quickly highlight the uh, earning potential for all participants. So writers can earn tokens by submitting articles and getting them successfully published in the network, while reviewers can earn by fact-checking and approving said articles. And lastly, readers can also earn by conducting certain actions such as suggesting topics for writers to cover, or flagging articles for additional inaccuracies after they've been published. So the tokens that are being earned by all these participants, they're called DCC tokens, and DCC tokens are more or less uh, an IOU, and they represent your proportional right to DNN tokens uh, based on your efforts on the platform. And at any point after these payout periods have been administered, DCC tokens can be swapped for DNN tokens uh, at any time. And DNN tokens are the tokens that represent the actual value on the platform. In terms of how we're building this, so far we've been envisioning DNN as a web-based application sitting on top of Ethereum with smart contracts facilitating the entire end-to-end -end review process. And articles that get approved are persisted off-chain to IPFS and then referenced on-chain by hash. And we're also using this really cool tool called ZeroNet, which is a BitTorrent-like protocol, which allows us to deliver the application without the need for a central server. And here's the best part. We've already built a large portion of this for our alpha, which we launched on Testnet uh, this past June. So it started off featuring very basic smart contract functionality, but so far the reception has been tremendous to the point that we've been making almost weekly, these like weekly updates to just refine and polish uh, what we've already got. So in terms of the next steps, we're looking to start planning out the um, look and feel of the beta while beginning to cultivate a network of writers, reviewers, and readers. And all the while, we've been engaging back and forth with journalists to test the strength of our editorial guidelines, which are the guidelines reviewers have to follow to approve articles. And beyond that, we will be conducting a pre-sale and crowd sale, the details uh, of which we will, announcing, uh, we will be announcing very, very soon, so definitely stay tuned for that. So overall, um, our team features a pretty well-rounded mix of experience across the tech industry as a whole, crypto of course, and the media industry. And we're super excited to be building something that we deem to be really, really ambitious. And we're even more excited that we, we, get, to use, um, we get to leverage Ethereum to do so. And uh, if anyone has any questions whatsoever, please don't hesitate to uh, reach out to us. Definitely feel free to join our Slack at uh, slack.dnn.media. We're always thrilled to 
answer any type of questions in like really, really great detail about all the, just the granular details about how we're implementing DNN and what we hope to achieve with it. So feel free to join our Slack, follow us on Twitter, all that good stuff. And overall, we're looking forward to seeing just how we can impact the future of creation uh, of the news on the blockchain. So thanks a lot for listening.